Hey guys, hope you all are well. I'm here today to talk to you guys about this week's product of the week, which is our XTC 3D. A lot of people don't even know that we have this product. We have a small box, we have a large box, and I'm here to tell you guys why this is product of the week, how does it work, and is it really worth it? XTC 3D is a protective coating for smoothing your finished prints. How it works is by taking the two liquids inside this kit, mixing them together, applying it to your print, then sanding it, and then you will be able to paint it. After this whole process is done, you should have no visible layer lines. It should be one completely smooth product. I'm gonna take through you guys step by step. How do you use this thing? How does it work? How do you apply it? The whole process, we're going to be applying it to a print that we have over here, and we're gonna be seeing the differences. I personally have not used XTC 3D before, so you guys are gonna get an in view right now of how easy it is to use and what is it like to use. Um, I'm gonna be using gloves in this, and what we're going to be using it on, I have two identical 3D prints of this little astronaut over here. One of them is going to be spray painted with a chrome and silver just as is straight from the printer. And the other one is going to be first coated with the XTC 3D and then going to be sanded. And then we're going to spray it with that same spray paint and see the differences. I've picked a specific spray paint that we can really see any imperfections. It's a glittery chrome silver kind of paint. It's in my opinion going to show the most defects if there are any. So here you can see a revolving video of the first print that we have already spray painted straight from the 3D printer. We have not sanded this, we have not XTC'd it, we're just from the printer and a spray paint. All right guys, what I'm gonna do now is show you what comes inside the box when you buy your XTC 3D. So, we're first greeted with a whole Ziploc bag, nothing else is inside yet. Inside of our Ziploc bag we have a cup for mixing, and I guess this is the brush for application. I think this is a stick that you can mix the two liquids together inside your mixing ratio. A part A, and a part B. And then we have a monster instruction manual. There we go. All right, guys, I'm going to quickly go read the instruction manual, figure out how do you mix this together. Like I said, I'm going to be using gloves for this because I want to be as safe as possible. And if you do do this, I recommend you guys use gloves as well. There are a couple of safety features on here for do not ingest, if you get it in your eye and all that kind of stuff. Let's be as safe as possible and let's see what happens. All right, so according to the instructions, we have to do a 200 part A and a 100 part B. So let's get mixing over here. There we go. And now we mix. All right guys, so according to the instruction, this is an epoxy. So it is not safe to ingest. It's not safe to use for uh, liquids. You can't 3D print a cup and put this on top and think you can drink out of it. It can be poisonous. Next, we're going to use our print and we're going to apply it with this brush. Let's give it a go. I'm going to start with the visor, then I'll work my way onto his head and then his body. All right, guys, it's a few hours later and our XTC 3D is dry and it actually seems and feels pretty smooth to me, so I don't think it's necessary to sand it. 
We're gonna give it a spray paint now and let's see how it comes out. And there you have it, you guys. The XTC did work quite well. Keep in mind, this is my first time using XTC 3D ever in my life. The instructions do say that you must apply the XTC, sand it, then apply it again, then sand it until you get the smooth desire that you want. But I applied it just once and I did not sand it and still it had such a great result. I'm gonna show you guys over here. Here's a nice example of a Batman that we printed with the correct method of XTC. I'm not entirely sure who in our shop did this. It was here before my time, but as you can see, it is really beautiful. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, XTC 3D is our product of the week. If you guys want to find it at our website, you can see the link below. It'll direct you directly to this product. Remember, we do have a small model and a big bottle i hope you guys enjoy it if you guys need to contact us here is our details below i hope you guys have a great day see you next week